and thanks for clicking on this video guys today we are actually here again with Astroneer because actually not all now it's not really clear how to move into other planets okay as soon as you get a spaceship or a shadow this is how it looks like once you eject from the earth then if you want to see the whole planetarium this is how it looks like here there is exotic arid and um, many many more planets so if you want to actually move out of this solar system you actually need to so if, for example if we want to reach those two planets over here we need to move first to the to the furthest of those planets so in this case i think the, um, this is not exotic i can't remember how the hell was this called so the little one was exotic and the other one was let's see let, we will be discovering it in a minute so this planet it doesn't want to tell me how is it called so i need to go arid so it's called arid so here we are in arid this is arid and this is the the solar system of arid basically from arid you can teleport to exotic and to radiate it so now we go a little bit deeper in the space and if we move a little bit over that direction we will be able to reach also this planet which is supposed to be tundra so this is first how you got into exotic and how you got into radiate baron is super easy because he is exactly the, he's exactly like super close to to the actual uh, to the actual earth or or the main planet where you actually spawn into so we are now going to get to tundra so this one is going out of our eyesight this is coming in and this is the furthest planet that we can get into so you just need to move from planet to planet in order to reach the last possible planet and as you will be able to see from this solar system okay we still have a lot of fuel then we have a lot of spaces where we can actually land too and this is the farthest planet in the solar system they built so far in Astronia. we are on it here there is arid here there is exotic here there is uh, arid no here there is something else <laughs> that i can't that i can't figure out what it is so we had arid uh, exotic then there was something else that i can't remember and then there is the earth and barren as well as you can see this is the farthest planet we could actually achieve there is nothing after this there is a planet here in the top and there is something that it doesn't make sense here in the top as well but apart from this this is totally the final planet and the ultimate planet you could possibly land into so you just need to get here I just clicked on the planet click on any of those I would go to one of those maybe this part just because it's a little bit colored let's see if this was a good idea or what then here we go here we land and there here you did it so you basically landed on the ultimate and the last planet in the universe of Astroneer so far it's super colored it has a really cool aurora and uh, you did it now all you have to do is getting out getting your habitat placing it whenever you want oh and i can't believe check it out guys I, this is the loot the best loot ever okay here we can plant it just by pulling this and now we are we are ready to start our base and our establishment on this plant and we spawned in the par with the best loot ever look all the loots are here i can't believe it. there is one here there is a mountain of loot and there is a mountain of loot over there this is fantastic so this is a totally tundra and uh, this was how you get to it well guys i hope this was this this tutorial was helpful in case it was or it wasn't let me know why in the comments below and if there is anything else you actually want me to cover just let me know and i'll be happy to reply to all your comments and to do any guide you can be possibly asking for so apart from that i will thank you one more time for staying with me until here and i will wish you a great afternoon ahead then i'll see you later in the arc survival evolved videos <laughs> cheers